face of it. We looked at the types of games and tools that carers use with the users at Cherry Road and decided that we would like to make an interactive MP3 player, which would remind them of familiar songs and sounds. We built a prototype sound box to house an Arduino and worked with electronics such as capacitive touch sensors and RFID car scanners, as well as Arduino coding to provide our first prototype. So the sensor yeah. is the blue the bit there. So it's small. Yeah. yeah. I would think maybe soften the edges though, just because it's a bit sharp mm -hmm. at the moment. Oh, colours. Yeah, colours yeah. for the box. <laughs> right. Wait a second. They have been here with the guys when they're here. They might have been able to get more of a, a time to have a chat with you. So you've picked up so much from such a limited input from us. It's incredible. Oh. Isn't it? Taking the feedback on board, we set about making our final prototype. We did some debugging of the code, built a new box with softer edges, and painted the box with bright colours. And with this, we created the sound box. We took our final prototype to the users and staff at Cherry Road. Pick which yeah. one, mm -hmm. right? Pick which one, and I'll take the others away. Yeah. You want that one? Pick it up then. What's uh -huh. it on? So, looking back now, I think it was really enjoyable working at Cherry Road with the staff and service users. And it was really nice to be able to design something specifically for people that we just met and worked with. Definitely. They were so friendly and gave us really great feedback as well. Yeah, I think it would be amazing to do something like this again.